everybody welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching so today's story will be in this makeup look right here i love the color of this lipstick i wasn't sure about what lipstick i'm gonna use today and then i saw this one and i was thinking about a more sophisticated look so i decided to use this one but of course this makeup is neutral and wearable for everyone it's just a little dramatic and you can use any lipstick that you want so let's begin i'm gonna start applying this concealer in my eyelid this is the studio finish concealer by mac I'm using this concealer to prime my eyelid and then I'm gonna use my fingers to blend this concealer creating a really thin coat like just a base for my eyeshadows and it will help to stand out more the colors of the eyeshadows that I'm gonna apply after I already did my skin if you wanna see how I do my skin in this video I'm gonna put the link here in the description box it's my previous video of contour and highlight update <music> using a blending brush I'm gonna apply this eyeshadow by Sigma this is the color Topaz you can use any warm brown eyeshadow that you have and I'm gonna apply this color and go blending slowly a little at a time in my crease and outer corner using the circular motions to make sure that there is no harsh lights this color in my lower lash line using the same brush now using the same brush I'm gonna use this matte dark brown eyeshadow in my crease and outer corner without cover completely the first eyeshadow because it will create a beautiful gradient of colors helping the transition and create more depth in the look making your eyes appear naturally bigger and more awake just changed the brush I'm using this short shader brush and the same brown eyeshadow that I was using before and so I'm gonna apply this color in my lower lash line it will balance more the look and connect the eyes in the lower lash line and outer corner now I'm gonna use this pigment by MAC this is the color misty looks like this and it's a really beautiful color To apply this pigment, I'm using this cream color brush, you can use any concealer brush if you want. I'm applying this pigment with a little bit of water, just to make the color stand out more. And to avoid the fallout, I'm gonna apply this pigment a little at a time, working the shadow all over my lid. my little 
Real Ingot Brush and my favorite gel eyeliner by Sigma this is the color Wicked. I love this gel eyeliner because it's waterproof and lasts so longer. I also like this eyeliner to apply in my waterline like I'm gonna do today. Using the gel liner is just a little bit harder to apply than the liquid eyeliner but I prefer the gel eyeliners because for me it lasts longer and you can use any eyeliner that you like. So I'm gonna do this eyeliner thin as possible in my eyelid and then I'm gonna create this big winged eyeliner. You don't need to use this eyeliner if you want to just apply your fake lashes, mascara and you are done with the eyes or you can do the eyeliner and apply fake lashes. This is all about your preference. This look I recommend to use throughout the day or night. I'm gonna also use this gel eyeliner in my waterline. I prefer to apply gel liner than any eye pencil because for me it lasts so longer. But you can use anything that it will make you comfortable with. For example, if you want to apply any different color in the waterline, you can do it because all the makeup is neutral. So it's looking like this. Now I just applied a little bit of black eyeshadow in my lower lash line. This is the color Noir by Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's a really pigmented eyeshadow. So be careful and use a little the time. And as any good black eyeshadow, be careful with the fallouts. <music> To create a more dramatic effect, I'm gonna use the same black eyeshadow and this pencil brush. I'm gonna apply this color directly in my outer corner on top of my black eyeliner. It will create a really depth in the look, it will make my eyes much more dramatic. And this look here, I recommend to use at night. So I go a little at the time working this eyeshadow in my crease and outer corner. More in my outer corner, just a little bit in the crease to balance the look and to make sure there is no harsh lines. <music> difference between the eye looks. I don't know what I like it more. What do you think guys? Let me know in the comments what's your favorite. So as I already did this darkest option, I'm gonna finish the another eye and then I'm gonna apply my fake lashes and mascara. <music> that I'm using is the style Scarlet by Huda Beauty. I love these lashes. And the lipstick is the color Utopia by Lime Crime. I love this color so much. And this blush that I'm using is the color Pinch Me by Motivus Cosmetics. I love this blush because it's really neutral. This blush is matte and stunning. So that's it my lovies. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe here in my channel for more news. And follow me on Instagram for more pictures of my work. It's always a pleasure to have you here with me and I see you in the next videos. Thank you.